This is the image of the Abbey of St. Mark, in the suburbs of the city of Spolto, where the holy abbot Eleutherius lived a life of intimate communion with God. Welcome to the Scent of the Day. Today, 6th of September, the Church celebrates the feast of St. Eleutherius, the abbot. We have scanty documented evidence on the life and activities of St. Eleutherius. However, the documented information that we have of him is from one of the pillars of the early Christendom, Pope St. Gregory the Great. A number of entries in the dialogues of Pope Gregory illuminates life at St. Mark under Abbot Eleutherius in the Abbey. The monks told Gregory that by his tears, Eleutherius raised up one that was dead. Eleutherius told Gregory that he had come across a young boy who lived in a nonary and was possessed by devils, had taken him back to San Marco, and with the help of the other monks had cured him. The dialogues also reveal that Eleutherius later moved to the monastery of Gregory in Rome. There, he cured Gregory of an illness that had prevented him from fasting at Easter. These words of Pope St. Gregory sums up the essence of St. Eleutherius. He was so simple a man, one of such great penance, that we must not doubt that Almighty God granted much to his tears and his humility. After resigning his abbacy, St. Eleutherius died in Rome in St. Andrew's Monastery, about the year 585. Tomorrow, the 7th September, St. Mark Oakson.